News shooter coverage of IBC 2025 is sponsored by B&H. Hi, it's Matt here for newshooter.com at IBC 2025 I'm with Nissi from Axoon. Now your new Cineview M7, M7 Pro. Um, they've just got some firmware upgrades and also you've got some new accessories. Yes, um, we launched the monitors, these an AB, and since uh, it's shipped, uh, we are constantly updating the system to make sure that it is always up to date. And uh, we hear a lot from the users about uh, what kind of features they would like to see on these monitors. And uh, first update is the camera control. We are ready on the selected Sony and Canon models for uh, basic parameters like ISO or shutter speed. Uh, adjustments on the screen and you can also do a record trigger also the touch focus and we are uh, also working on other camera models and uh, from also other brands as well another update is the transmitter update um, previously it only works the M7 Pro only works as a monitor and the receiver but within these months we will release the transmitter firmware so that you can use the M7 Pro as a trans wireless transmitter and then send wireless video to up to four different devices. And a combination of another M7 Pro set to receiver mode or another Cineview Master 4K receiver or uh, iOS or Android mobile uh, applications. So up to four devices receiving the M7 Pro as a more transmitter. Besides software size update, we also have uh, the hardware updates. Uh, people are asking for V-Lock power. So we have this uh, V-Lock adapter ready so that you can just mount to the back of the monitors at both M7 or the M7 Pro and power it through a V-mount battery. This is already available. Uh, the retail price is uh, 99 US dollar. And you've also done an update for the Cineview Master 4K as well. Uh, yes, um, we have updated the Master 4K so that it has the capability of end-to-end uh, -end H.265. Uh, you can transmit and also record or process uh, video under 265 and with a better image quality and less the file size. And also another update for the Master 4K is that it can now transmit up to 10 uh, receiving units. Also a combination of say 10 M7 Pro monitors or uh, 10 Master 4K receivers or 10 apps, like a mix and match from different combinations.